Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got this big, huge box to unbox. It was sent to me by Sister Chic, and um, I actually showed some restraint and did not open this at work. <laughs> um, considering I had been dying for this to see her new collections, um, I think I did pretty good. So I got that open successfully without cutting my fingers. And um, just look at this. <laughs> Miss Debbie is so the queen of packaging. Got me a little card. I'm going to open that up in private. And um, I'm going to make room over here for all these little beautiful pink fuzzies. She knows I love me some pink. <laughs> And here is the paper about these collections. And um, we will get into that here in just a little bit. Okay. So this first envelope is, uh, <laughs> it's heavy. This is the Fall Moonlight Madness Collection 2018. And um, I'm going to go ahead and move this box here. So we've got that. And we've got a bunch of Sister Scrub. This is Ocean Mist. And these are 8 ounces. Oh, that looks so pretty. Can you all see how pretty? And then we've got an unscented one, which is really nice. It's a hand sugar scrub. And pretty too. And then we've got Mango Madness. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, 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 I can't wait to smell it. And then finally, this last one is It's Magic Inside. This one doesn't have a label. So I don't know what its name is, but we're going to love it all the same. Okay. So let me get um, my scissors and get some room cleared off here, and we're going to open this up and see what's going on. Alrighty. We're going to get this open. <laughs> I am so excited. I am so, so excited. So there's actually two collections in here, and... Um, I am really, really excited. I'm almost giddy as a schoolgirl. So here we go. Okay, so we're going to start with the Halloween Trio. How about that? I'll tell you what. Mm, yes. <laughs> I'm a little indecisive today. So, there's two collections in this bag. We've got the Halloween Trio and then the Fall Collection. So, let's get into the Halloween Trio. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. So, oh, this first beautiful polish is Things That Go Bump. <laughs> I love the name. It is such a pretty purple. Oh, my gosh. It's um, it's a fig cream with um, subtle red shimmer. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I love it. Okay, next. This video is going to be forever long because I'm also going to be swatching all of these. <laughs> it's going to be an un unboxing, a swatching. It's just going to be a party up in here. Okay. Let's see if I can get this out of here. I don't want to have to break out the scissors. I'm not very graceful with scissors. Oh, my. Look at that. Oh, heavens. That is, oh, my gosh. Monster Mash. Oh. This is the namesake of the collection. And it's a bright green Crelly. And be careful with your application. as She can flood if you have a strong C curve. But she's succulent and juicy once dried. Oh, my Debbie. Oh, that's so fun. Oh, and I can so see these together. Oh, totally stoked. Okay, next. 
This is like Christmas. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm glad I opened this one last because I might would have stroked. Okay. Look at that. Oh, this one is called Heebie Jeebies. I say that all the time. Oh, it gave me the Heebie Jeebies. Um, she said she almost called this one Bats in My Bell Fry because the black shards look like little black bats on the nail. Um, she, this one's got lots of gold and red and bronze and iridescent glass flecks. This is going to look real. She says it looks pretty evergreen, and I bet you. Uh, oh, and bright orange. Yes, 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 yes. From the fall collection, which we haven't even gotten to yet. Look. Look. Oh. Oh, Debbie. Oh, my gosh. Okay. i got to get it together. We're going to be here all day. Okay, that is the Monster Mash Trio. Um... I'm going to get into some specifics. The collection launches October October 1st, and the price is going to be $9 per bottle. I will have links for everything down below, as I always do. Oh, this is just too much fun. Okay, now on to the Harvest Moon collection. We're going to open up this orangey-looking one first, because it had referenced in the last video. Ooh. Oh. Okay. This one is Harvest Moon. I'm going to get it up here so y'all can see it while I'm talking about it. Um, this was inspired by Pantone color number 021C. It's a beautiful, bright fall orange with gold shimmer. If you've ever seen a Harvest Moon, you'll know this polish captures the beauty of the orange gorgeousness. And I'm seeing some pink in there too. I'm definitely seeing, oh, that's just beautiful. Okay, next we have, ooh, oh, this is the kind of polishes I've been like just stoked over, but this one is just, oh, okay, this is Moonlight Madness, so here we go, let's get a bottle shot while we're talking, Moonlight Madness, Madness is a beautiful black crelly with gold flecks and silver and gold micro glitter, oh, that's just, oh, gosh, I can't wait to swatch these, oh, my heavens, Debbie, you have outdone yourself. Okay, next. Ooh. Okay, this one's called Sapphire Moon. Okay, so let's read it. A voluptuous sapphire shimmer. Note this one needs a good base coat. Uh, uh, I'm seeing some shimmer in there, some little bling bling. Oh, that is so funny. Okay, totally off track. Um, when I was pregnant with my first child, uh, I was out in Virginia, and my family lived here in Tennessee. And um, I teased my mother that if it was going to be a little girl, I was just going to name her Sapphire. No middle name, just Sapphire Fitzpatrick. Had my mother on her head for days. I would have never done that, but it was fun. But Sapphire is... <laughs> Oh, and to be Sapphire Moon, that is just too funny. Okay, and the final polish from the Harvest Moon collection is Stinkin' Crazy Pretty. Oh, okay, this one is called The Silvery Moon. Oh, this one is a, has purple undertones with a strong sur silver iridescence. Is she silver? Is she purple? Yes! She's both. Have fun describing this one, ladies, is what she tells us. I'm telling, yeah. This is, it, seriously. She has given us some homework here. I'm telling you. Alright. So, enough of that goodness. We're going to have to, I guess, get some naked nails so we can swatch stuff. I'll be back. <laughs> 